I, it's almost the full moon in Scorpio. I can feel it approaching. And I thought, as this is a time when the spirits are really active, when we're really feeling the beautiful, bountiful magic of the full moon, and especially in Scorpio, which is such a psychic, deep, powerful sign. And I'm not saying that just because my own moon is in Scorpio. I'm saying that because it is what it is. <laughs> I wanted to honor this full moon in Scorpio by doing the Emprix Moon Tarot Spread by Angela Mary Magic. This is a beautiful heart warming, empowering, transformative, giant spread. And it is only two cards. So I thought it'd be so perfect for this full moon in Scorpio. But before we get into that reading, I wanted to start off with a libation that will support me. So right here, I have some water, just some plain, beautiful water. And I'm going to be filling it with some essences, some essences. <laughs> I love flower essences, and I wanted to do some that would honor the psychic nature of this full moon in Scorpio. So the first one I'm doing is Rainbow Vision, of course. If you can all see it. It has chamomile, eucalyptus, yucca. Um, it has dolphin. This is an essence that I made um, before I went to Desert Days last year and I saw Angela Mary Magic and her beautiful family and we did this incredible workshop where we worked with a local pepper plant. I love working with divination with plants and so of course I'm bringing some plant essences. So I'm gonna put some of this. My divine friend Alyssa. I'm gonna be linking everyone below so you can see all these beautiful, bountiful people created this marsh marigold essence that I've been really connecting with. It, um, I made the label so, <laughs> so if you can see it. Um, marsh marigold really works with stagnant energy, it allows us to thrive in stagnation. So I think it's really powerful during this time of quarantine to work with where we are, you know, and this plant is so supportive and I've been really appreciating having it. So just mixing it up. <laughs> some March Marigold. And last but definitely not least, I am so excited to be adding a little bit of this Sun Song Periwinkle Flower Essence. Oh my gosh, this beautiful flower has been such an ally, has been really supportive during this time. Periwinkle really allows us to transform reality, to open up to multiple dimensions, and to allow the flow to happen. So I really feel that this periwinkle will pair so beautifully with the marsh marigold that Alyssa Boudé created. Hypnotize is her name, and I said I'm, I'm going to be linking both Say One O of Sunsong and Alyssa also below. Um, Angela Mary Magic as well, and so I'm mixing this up. Put a little bit of this into the drink. Okay, <laughs> so now my water's been supercharged.
Wow. <laughs> I can immediately feel my third eye opening. I'm feeling expansive, powerful. I definitely want some protection to invite some protection in. I'm working with this almost empty, incredible 13 Archangels from Blue Rose Botanics. I'm going to be spraying a little bit now for myself and for you all here watching. Yes. Inviting in all the 13 Archangels to be here with this reading, knowing that the Dark Moon in Scorpio does not play around. <laughs> it is a very powerful time. Yes, I can feel the Archangels here with us. They are present. They are guarding and holding space for us. I'm super grateful to have them here. And I'm also feeling called to light a little bit of sage, to say thank you to the spirits. To honor this sacred space that we're holding together, that with, we're holding with one another. Thank you for being a part of this tarot reading. For really opening up to see what messages are wanting to come in during this full moon in Scorpio. So the first card in the Emperix Moon Tarot spread is the wild card, and that is our wild energy, what it comes from within us intuitively, powerfully, that comes without even thinking. Oh wow, and so what comes forward is the weaver. <laughs> So the weaver holds us all together. They are the divine being that creates all the interconnections, the mycelial web, the spider's beautiful home. The weaver connects us beyond time and space. And for them to come up in the wild card here with the Empress, it really shows us that our wild selves, we know where we are, who we are, what we're connected to. We feel each other. Our webs are moving through our bodies and that we will find each other. We will connect to each other and that we will hear each other's messages. And I think this really makes me think of all of the people that have been visiting me in the astral realms that have been sending me their energies in so many different ways the ways that we play with each other up in the those beautiful etheric realms and so we're always finding ways to stay woven together and that is our wild nature it is a nature that nothing can stop and so in this full moon in scorpio let yourself feel that wild interconnectedness that you are part of a system of life, an eco-shed, a system of sustenance, of nurturance, of care. Let that wild magic of that system that moves through you, that is you, to support you and hold you in all the wildness. <sighs> and so the second card in this incredibly gorgeous Emperix Moon Tarot spread is the free card. What is our liberation? What is our freedom? And I'm going to hold up the Weaver, which was our wild card, and next to it, I'm going to be unveiling. <laughs> so I'll put them together like this to create a beautiful heart. So we are free to be visionaries, to dream, to imagine, to open up those third eyes, that crown chakra, our hearts, our throats, all of our chakras, to open them up in this beautiful rainbow that 
powerfully, prismatically moves through us. We are rainbow vision. <laughs> we are rainbow vision. We are rainbow vision. We are rainbow vision. We are rainbow vision. Let yourself feel the freedom of our rainbow vision. We are free to dream, to play and to create together, to imagine realities that do not even exist in this moment. We need our dreams and our visions more than ever. They are our freedom. We are always free within our consciousness, our awareness. Our rainbow vision is our freedom. Our rainbow vision is our freedom. Our rainbow vision is our freedom. So praise Goddess for our rainbow vision. Praise the Empress for this divine wisdom of these two cards. <laughs> I'm just feeling the energy of the Empress here. It is so powerful and I'm so grateful to you, Angela Mary Magic, for creating such an incredible heart-centered, heart-opening, giantess spread. <sighs> Definitely grateful to this message on this full moon in Scorpio. I hope that these messages can be a part of your gift this full moon. I hope that these messages can support you during this full moon in Scorpio. I would love to hear what kinds of messages come in for you. Scorpio is an incredibly psychic um, sign. And so when it, the moon is in Scorpio, it is definitely a time of receiving messages, of communing with ancestors and with spirits. So work your rainbow vision this full moon in Scorpio. Really grateful to all of you for this time and for being a part of this channel. Definitely subscribe if you're not um, subscribed. Hit that notification bell um, and share my my page, share my channel. I would love to continue to offer these um, videos and I'm really grateful to the beautiful web. And also, as I said, I'm gonna be linking all of the people that I spoke about in this video below so that you could follow them as well and check out their incredible offerings too. Have a magical moon in Scorpio. See you soon. <laughs> Bye.